Go ahead. Down here with a friend, whatever, but I'm out to interview him and ask him uh, what he thinks about the beach, sir. Wait, wait, wait. How do you uh, feel about the beach? Like the beach weather and all that kind of stuff down here. Is it nice down here? It's beautiful. You heard the phrase, it's beautiful. You can sit back, relax, whatever. You got nice looking females walking by. You got, got the show. Uh huh. Got the show. Got the show, whatever. You know what I mean? You can sit back, whatever, smoke you want, whatever. You can see some nice butts, or some sloppy butts, <laughs> people's guts hanging out, whatever. You know what I mean? But it's for everybody. You got niggas down here kissing niggas. You know what I mean? It's a place for everybody. It's for all the people. It's for everybody, whatever. Like, just stare around. Just stare around the people, whatever. You know what I mean? It's a mixture of crowds. Even though, even though you know, it's a bunch of black people, whatever. But that's a good thing, because not having as much black people is like not having as much drama. You know what I mean? I don't like all that kind of stuff, whatever. So as you see, whatever, kicking it with my homie. So you know what I mean? Something like whatever. You know, it's a beautiful day, whatever. Thank God that everybody's here, whatever. But summertime isn't a place to, uh, to get calm out here, it's a place to make it hotter. So we gonna turn this motherfucker up, whatever. I don't know about we hope it, but Dober shooting people, whatever. So I'm gonna try to bring in some of that violence down here and shoot some shit up. up. That's how I'm looking at it. <laughs> oh, and uh, a word of advice: never bring crabs to the city. Oh, is the camera really on? Oh, look, that's Yana. <laughs> doesn't like some of y'all. Yeah, dark. Yeah, that's good. I've been dark. See, I'm darker because I'm facing the sun. If I was wasting sun, whatever, then light would be hitting on me, whatever. I would think you would know that, being that you have a camera. Why are people always judged by what they got on? That's why I'm worth shit. So you can't judge me. So that's why I ain't got no shirt on, whatever. So they can't judge me. They can't tell whether or not I have money, whatever. So if I don't wear no shirt, whatever, what does that say, whatever? Whether I'm fat or skinny or got muscles, you still won't know if it's like I ain't got no shirt on. Or uh, I guess because I'm up from in a wheelchair and slime on his phone and shit, whatever, he must got money. <laughs> Tech must come in. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Tech must come in. You know what I mean? If a motherfucker walking around with uh, track shoes or whatever and uh, starters and fubus and Saconis and shit, whatever, they probably ain't got no money, whatever. They still gonna have money. It might be saving it. Just because you want to save your money don't mean that you got to stunt, whatever. Just because a nigga not stunting don't mean he ain't got money, whatever. But I don't, I don't judge people. I let people judge me. I want to be on, on everybody's jury and I want to be guilty. I want to be guilty of, of being me. I'm gonna be guilty of guilty. I'm gonna, like, gonna be guilty. <laughs> you know what I mean? I'm guilty as charged. You ain't got charged me. I'm already saying I'm guilty. I ain't pleading the fifth. Fuck it, I'm guilty. Lock me up, whatever. Do a crime. I did it. Lock me up. And I go to court, skip the court. Y'all can lock me up. Uh, it, it, it never matters to me. Or, or then again, if a girl is wearing a dress, whatever, or like if a girl, what? Man, fuck what people look. Look, look, if a girl wearing a dress like this or whatever, and she probably fuck it, right? Yeah. Short dress on. Why don't I get Short dress on. Man, the feels supposed to be me, man. Fuck these gay people out here. Look. I'm with gay people. I don't want to. Look, I ain't saying nothing wrong with them, but I ain't saying nothing right with them. I don't want to be around no gay. I don't know gay people. I'm gay. But you're a girl, it's different. Because then a guy always has in his mind whatever, oh, if a girl's gay, maybe I can hook up with her and her friend, whatever, and fuck the both of them. Oh, yeah, where the gay bitches at? Not the gay niggas. <laughs> you like gay niggas? No, I'm not gay, you Go to show y'all, you should judge people because it can be wrong. And you believe in don't judge a book by its cover? Does the original box of Parallel Crayons have a black crayon in it? Yes. Oh, what was your question again? <laughs> Doesn't the front of the book like tell you what it's about? So like if you look at a person, what you see them as is how they're gonna be, right? No. Not all the time, but No look. <laughs> Just because now I'm quite sure y'all motherfuckers seen plenty of book covers. A book cover has nothing to do with the book. A book cover might give you a uh, like a pinch, like a like a little sprinkle of salt of an idea of how the book might be but the you start reading the motherfucking book, you start realizing like yo this shit's crazy. But look, I don't go fuck with it's summertime, they're no fucking books. What they don't worry about with making sure like that. Like, I meet a random bitch to have a condom to go on her, so that way I don't end up with two or three baby moms, whatever, because one's enough for me, whatever. And I'm wearing the book. That's the only book I'm gonna carry. And guess what? On the front of that condom, whatever, I need all, I need to know all I need to know, whatever, because I ripped that bitch open. There's my book right there. Stupid. The end. <laughs>